friends how are you today welcome to our food channel this is where um, we talk to you and tell with you about all the healthy foods there are our channel is called we, we got two names at the moment still thinking which one will go best nutri life is where we talk about all the nutrients in the food that we eat and then we're also thinking sunshine food Africa because our focus is going to be mainly on African foods. But anyway, let's look at Nutri Life today because today is all about nutrients. We're trying to ensure that people have nutrients in the food they eat. So, my name is Joy Fido, and I'm going to be chatting you through this. Welcome on board. Um, a clip on WhatsApp today where we've been told that people have been injected and this is across the world it started in israel now it's happening in the u.s and it's happening in most parts of the world where young women have been injected so they cannot have children but these women are not aware of what is going on and so they end up being sick and from being sick more sickness is coming and so much is happening to their life now the whole reasoning behind this, this program I watched was on RT, Russia television. So this is not just a hook. The reasoning behind this is they want to cut down on the population of the world. They think that we are overpopulated. So let them cut down on the numbers. So that way people should not have more children. And this is happening mostly to the minority groups. So that the number of children born in these groups are very few. So. This is really scary. That's why I preach here all the time, make your food your medicine. Now, if you eat healthy, you will not be looking for medicine. But you know what they say, if you don't eat healthy, if you don't make your food your medicine, you end up making medicine your food. And I've seen so many people who are doing that. All they eat is medicine. They have to drink so much amount of medicine to survive a day. When all you could have done is just eat healthy food and you don't need the medicine. So that's a big message coming from this Nutri-Life. It's all about nutrients in your food. Okay, so I'm going to start preaching now and then I'm going to focus on what we're doing today. Today we're just trying to create a quick smoothie that you can have for yourself and give to your children as well. My focus with this smoothie is for my children. So that's what today's smoothie is about quick smoothie that you can give to the children and you can also have but remember it's always about the nutrients in your food so let's focus on the ingredients what are the things we're working with first is the strawberries so strawberries all neatly washed and put in these beautiful plates here then we have the spinach the baby spinach all nicely washed here as well and then we have our banana okay bananas there and what's in this glass is a glass of milk pasteurized milk this is a full bottle of it so this is the main thing going in here and then milk to become the liquid but remember what the nutrients are in this food i i was reading one of those healthy food magazines and it said um, the reason we should stay away from processed food is because of the zero, I mean the calories that we take from processed food are just empty calories so the body takes the calories but there's nothing in it there's no nutrients in the calories so whenever you're eating this is the big message from Nutri Life make sure you know the nutrients in the food that you're eating and so the nutrients here for spinach is iron spinach is packed with iron and this is why i really do this because my son he gets tired very easily so i had to find a way to make sure he's having iron in his diet and then strawberries is all about vitamin c and antioxidants which of course cleanses your body remember we have lots of what they call uh, free radicals in our body and so antioxidants are like broom they come and chase away the free radicals which are the things that make you ill then banana is potassium again banana is food on its own so if you're into sports banana is one of the best things you should have again my young son who's into sports doesn't like banana 
But if I make it in a smoothie form, he, he gets it. He doesn't mind it. So that's why this is here. And I want you to encourage your children to eat healthy because it's good for their health. We're trying to create a brighter future. Milk, of course, has lots of things. Calcium, one of them for the bones. So milk here. Now, if I was in Africa, remember we said Sunshine Africa food, I would have gotten coconut milk or any other local milk. There's another one we have, which I, I need to do a video one of these days. Um, I think I've done one, but I'm not sure. It comes with a lot of milk in it as well. So there's so many other types of milk I would use if I was back in Nigeria. But here we got the pasteurized milk and it's there for you to use. Okay, so let's get on with this. Then your Nutribullet. Um, again, when it comes to the blender, I always say blender is blender. So don't worry about the brands. Um, people who love Nutribullet will make a big deal about it. Nutribullet. Um, I've used it, but I don't use it that often if I'm not doing a video. So you put your strawberries in your blender. I'm going to try and do all of this, but for the sake of this video, I'll just put enough to go. Because this, this is the one flaw I don't like about Nutribullet. It doesn't take much. See that? That's about right. And then we put some of our spinach in there. Nutribullet doesn't like things going after. I see that. That's supposed to be the maximum. So I'll make sure it stays within the position they've said it should be in okay so then you get your banana ready and you just put that in again the size of this blender is giving me problem but um, I'll try my best so I've just put just one banana in there and then I pour my milk in there so I'm not going to make it too much because I don't like it being too watery and I certainly don't want it being too thick because some people don't like it too thick. That's my young son. Um, what you could do is if, if you think it's getting too full, you just um blend it so once it's all blended then it gets a bit squashed and then you add more ingredients but that's gone in and so now i'm going to press that in and I'll close it so now let's hope we're within the maximum which is about there so we're still okay so now i'm going to start blending nicely blended um if you want a bit more done you just put it in again now that looks perfect to me so you open it and it's ready to go okay so once we've got our um what's this smoothie ready we just pour it into the glass ready to serve and that's how simple this is so normally i fill the glass for both of them the two young we're gonna get our models to come and drink so you get to know that this is us gorgeous as it is so they're coming to drink now and then we can then blend that later so here's your gorgeous drink ah uh, sorry that filled a little bit on the side so once you finish drinking tell us what you think of it i know you love it you're, you're drinking nearly every day these days
really nice. What does it taste like though? I can taste the banana the most. Mm -hmm. And the strawberries. Yeah. So is it creamy? Mm -hmm. It's like <coughs> juicy. Thick. Thick. Thick mm -hmm. Goes really smoothly down your throat. Yeah. Smoky. Yeah. So very mm -hmm. creamy. Yeah, so that's our young models for you and would you drink this often? Would you share with your friends if you had to? Yeah. <laughs> so God, that's Garen for you. He usually never want to go near bananas. But once he has done in this form, he doesn't mind it at all. He drinks it happily. And for someone who is so much into sports, he needs iron in his body. And that's what the spinach does. Mega too is very much into sports. She's very active. So we need things that help their body grow properly without just drink, you know, eating all the crisp and all the packaged foods and the biscuits and the sweets that don't really add anything to their body. That's where the empty calories are. So we need to give them calories that got a lot of nutrients in them. So let's build a brighter future for our children. So anyway, that's been a really short video just to give you something to kickstart your day and keep you going healthy um we need to be we'll be bringing you more and more quick quick short short clips of things like this just to show you how we try our best to stay healthy as well so see you in the next video and thank you so much for watching um we look forward to seeing the next one remember to subscribe and remember to share with your friends and so you'll be informed whenever we're doing something new so bye guys say bye bye yeah.